I found this image, I think it was from an art history textbook, and I had the original copy. So I did photocopy it on my laser printer so that I could save the original for other uses as well. But I really liked the anonymous face with that ancient age represented in the distress and the damage to the stone. So I decided that for this spiral inspiration, I wanted to be inspired by Celtic spirals, in particular the spirals of like woad tattoos on ancient picts in Scotland and the like. Um, woad is a, a plant-based material, so it goes onto your skin. In some ways it's like henna, although henna gets darker the longer it stays on your skin, and woad is pretty much um, instant. So it's a paste, it's painted on, boom, you have uh, blue designs stained on your skin. Short term, you know, not temporary like tattooing. And really, it's just going to be as simple as playing with this um, Celtic design mask. It is from Stencil Girl Studios. I decided that I would use some ink. This is like a juniper green, so it's a very teal color, and I'm mixing it with gel medium because I wanted it to be a little bit more transparent than if I had just used acrylic paint. The color turns out to be a little intense, which you'll see in a minute, but it really makes the pattern show very clearly, and I think it's pretty, um, pretty striking. Uh, so check this out. I'm almost tempted to leave it plain, but I decided I wanted to do another layer of blue. So this is a, it's a golden fluid acrylic. I don't remember exactly which blue it is, probably just a cobalt. And I wanted to pull in some designs. You'll see on the right a graphic from a Celtic design book. And I was thinking of the design from the Battersea Shield. This is actually from the back of a mirror. And I liked that these kind of spirals. They're also kind of waveforms. They are circles and broken circles. And so I'm just using it as inspiration, doing my own modified versions of some of those spirals on the left-hand side of this spread. That way I've got two different kinds of blues and different layers of interest. This page is going to be pretty simple, uh, but there was a nice meditative flow to just painting this in. 
Oh, and by the way, I've sped this clip up just two times, but the remaining clips are going to be sped up a little bit faster because, you know, it's kind of fun to watch, but also you see where I'm going with this. And I just wanted you to follow it through to see the finished page at the end. Thank you.